How does it feel to be here at this event? It's amazing, your husband's being honored. It's so it's such an honor to be by his side and see all the love and support he's receiving for all these amazing people at Cedar sinai Absolutely. Now, in terms of health, do you have advice that you would give younger people, millennials, maybe drink water, get more sleep? I mean, all that is very good, but I mean, of course, we want to drink more water and make sure we get a lot of sleep. But really, it's about being mentally sound and making sure that we take care of our brains and really um, focus on things that are important and not get too caught up in what everyone else is doing on Instagram and how everyone is living these lives. We really need to take care of our mental stability. That will keep us healthy and sane the rest of our lives. Now, how do you go about doing that? Do you do meditation? Do you just unplug for a little bit? I, I try to unplug, but I also try to stay connected with the people that I love. I keep very, a very small group around me that are truly the people that support me and I support them. Lastly, it's Breast Cancer Awareness Month. There's a lot of charity events right now. What, what causes are important to you? Which causes? Well, this is very important to me and also Camp Cortisone because my daughter has had two open heart surgeries. So this helps support children that um, can go to camp and do all, that, all the wonderful things that young children do. So it sends children to camp that um, can't go to a normal camp in the summer. So it's all kids that have had heart defects or are dealing with it.